Luke Trick, how in the world did we meet? I think we met in another streamer's uh, Apex Customs uh, sh stream, which was like Kellogg's, I believe. Oh, that's right. That's yeah, right. I, I dropped that $100 dono and then, oh, yeah. and then I became like the celebrity in, in that entire <laughs> chat. So everyone's like, oh, Luke Trick. Uh, that is, uh, that's actually, you're, you're literally correct, man. That, I remember that, dude. Kellogg was freaking go, he was flipping out, dude. That was so cool. Um, give a little, maybe a little history of, uh, how you came into starting your channel. Um, maybe why you started your channel and, uh, how long you've been, uh, doing YouTube and I guess now kick. Um, so, uh, I created my channel back in, I think, 20, 20, I think it was around 2012, maybe. I just made it just because, you know, everyone was like making uh, Facebook accounts. I had a friend who like had a Facebook account and then like everyone was making YouTube. At the time, like at, at the age, like I was only like 11. So I, yeah. it was not, it was not like, it, it was not like what people recommended for like, like 11 year olds to like make accounts on like the internet, but I did anyways. And I, I just had a YouTube channel just because why not? I didn't really do much on it um, throughout middle school and high school. Um, it was sort of just, you know, just my account, just going through YouTube and uh, subscribing to people who I enjoy. Um, I didn't take it seriously until during the, the pandemic in 20, yeah, it was in 2020. Uh, I, I recently graduated from, from high school. Um, uh, I, I graduated while, while the pandemic started. So it's kind of like everything was kind of, um, very different to how, um, graduating seniors, uh, would have in, mm -hmm. uh, in their senior year. Hmm. It was very different. Everything was, I didn't get my prom <laughs> yeah. and I, uh, my graduation was kind of like a bit, bit different and all and stuff. So I, re I graduated and stuff. And then the pandemic was kind of, I still didn't really know what I w wanted to do in, in life. So the, the pandemic was kind of like, cause everyone, it, 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 it was, it was, they, they were telling everyone to stay inside and stuff. So I decided, or I, I kind of used that as an excuse to like, you know, not really do anything. So at the time after graduation, I didn't really have any, didn't really do anything at all. I wasn't really working or taking school at the time. I was thinking of going into audio engineering at the time. So, um, but it was only, it was, it was, it was a, f uh, spring, uh, class. So I was kind of waiting for that. But other than that, I was kind of like not doing anything at all. Um, and then I started looking, watching streamers. Not for me back then. I was, I honestly, I never thought that I would ever like think that I would be a st streamer at all. I thought streaming was kind of, kind of like, not like it, it wasn't like my interest at all. Like I always see people watch like streaming. And I'm like, nah, I, I don't think that would be fun at all. And then I started uh, watching other streamers. So I. For me, I am an Apex streamer. I, I've been playing Apex since, I guess the start, but I didn't really like start playing until season two. Uh, took a break from, or I didn't, I, I didn't have any interest until I got that one, one win in season two. <laughs> <laughs> After that, I was like, yo, I'm locked in into this game. Yeah, so I was, I was still interested in Apex. Uh, I was just playing my own time. Uh, and then I ran, I. I was going through YouTube and then during the AF, I think it was like season six, um, one of the events, uh, there was a, there's a streamer, you may know him, Nocturne Owl. Mm -hmm. uh, he was he was still growing. He was at like 5K and I just stumbled upon his stream and then I said hello and then he said hello. He was like the first streamer I, like, I actually um, had in, like ever like a streamer that I, I actually watched for uh, during that time and I was like, oh, yo, he's actually, he actually said hi to me. So, and then he kind of inspired me to, to start streaming myself. 
Um, he was at yeah, he was at five k. Uh, he only he only had like sixty viewers. Um, but he 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 inspired me to to like maybe do do streaming. Yeah. So yeah. So he he inspired me to do streaming. So in season seven, I was think I was I was planning on do, like at the start at the debut of season seven, I was thinking of streaming. Um, but during that time, like it was kind of everything kind of like I I didn't I I wasn't sure if it was gonna work out because at the same time, like something like some family matters happened at the exact same time. So right when season seven launched. Um, some family mem matters kind of happened at the same time, so I felt like I felt like that was kind of where I thought oh, I didn't wasn't sure if this was gonna work out, hmm. and then but I, I still I was still able to stream um, after that, and um, you know I always I always had I always have this like mindset, you know, to like it, it if you if you give up on something. If you were, give up on like a dream, um, it, uh, you, you're, yeah, you, you pretty much give up. Just if you, if you want, if you want, if you have a dream and if you want some, if you want something that you want, you go for it. You know, it may, it may not come like, uh, as soon as you think. Uh, but you know it. T time if, if you take your time and be patient you know you it will your time will come uh i've always i've always said that and i've always had that mindset so even though i'm like i was still a small streamer i didn't have any viewers i still i always i always had that mindset i always tell everybody to like you know don't give up on your dreams you know it, it's the same thing for people who who go to college you know um people go to college they take their time to study and put all their time and then after they graduate college you know they might go to university and then you know get their dream job you know they they get their dream job because they they uh kept on working on their goals you know that, that's pretty much what i did at, or that's kind of the mindset i kept which was to uh focus on my goals and uh just keep on grinding and then uh, I, I only streamed like a couple of times and then uh, after a couple streams, I started getting viewers. I started, I started getting people to come up on the streams or on one stream. I was like, yo, this is cool because I've never had this many viewers before. And then ever since then, I it uh, it took off for me. I, I've been pretty much just streaming since um, 2020 uh, of November. Yeah, well, what, what was the other questions? <laughs> Um, we were talking about your channel, but now, you know, now I got some more questions for you though. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. <laughs> yeah, right on. Um, wh what are you afraid of? Mm, I think right now I'm kind of, mm, I'm, I'm a bit, a bit worried about, you know, the future because I'm, I kind of do want to do the whole social media, AKA like content creator, mm -hmm. uh, thing. You know, I, 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 like I said, you know, it, take, it takes time. Some, for some people, it takes time. Others, it, it may go faster. Um, yeah, right now, I'm, I'm, it's kind of like my, my, my parents don't really, uh, see it as, like a future. I've never, I've never actually told them, or I've only, I, I, I've told them about this, but, um, they don't really know about like that you could actually turn this into like a career. And they've always wanted me to go to uh, school. Um, you know, my sister, they, they're proud of my sister, you know, she, for being for being a nurse, you know, she's a nurse right now. And, you know, I graduated at high school and then um, I didn't really do anything really. And I'm not in school right now. So it's kind of like, I'm kind of confused of, it's kind of confusing for everyone of like where, where I'm trying to go. Uh, I'm trying to take this YouTube or the streaming route right now, but I'm, I'm kind of I'm kind of uh, afraid about the future because um, right now I'm not really we're not really financially uh, good right now. You know, mm -hmm. I, I do have a job. Uh, I'm trying to balance that and trying mm -hmm. to do the whole streaming thing. 
but also I'm not sure about what my parents uh, think about me doing or doing this instead of uh, going to school. So what really. what do so, what do they think what do they think you're doing in your room for eight hours a day? Oh no, they know they know I game. <laughs> they they know I game for sure. They just don't. <laughs> nah, but they they don't really know about like the whole yeah that's the cool. whole uh, YouTube thing and stuff. So and what what have you said to yourself? Like, what would be acceptable to them for you to finally say that you're you're doing this like monetarily, truly? Like, what what would they have to like? What would they have to see to to be okay with it? Um, I think. If I showed them the the growth I've made on YouTube, and um, in the future, if like when if if I when I grow more, you know, I'll probably show it to them eventually, and then I'll show them the uh, growth I've done. They they'll probably be um, more accepted. Like a million subs a million subscribers, and then you can finally get the acceptance from your parents. I think like a hundred, hundred thousand, hundred thousand. If, if if I can show them like it, it's a it's a stable uh, you know income, then I think that would be acceptable. What does success look like to you? Success is would look like me with uh, my family. Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, when I when I yeah. when I know that. Um, they are happy for me, and that I've made the, them proud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your parents. Yeah, definitely. That's kind of that's cool. So family is pretty important to you, man. Mm hmm. Yeah, well, for me. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So it was kind of like rough for me growing up. Um. It's especially my high school. Um. Mm -hmm. Back in 2013, my parents uh, separated. Mm -hmm. So it was like not a, not really a good time for me because I was mm. still I was kind of young and I've always I've always wanted, you know, my family to be happy together. Yeah. Um, but life happens and I struggled I struggled through that. Uh, I I just I used gaming as kind of like my my cave, mm. um, to uh kind of <laughs> uh, take me away from that. What's Man. what's the next what's the next step? What's the next step then for for your channel? Unless you don't want to like reveal inside the the vault. It's a secret. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, I want to I want to I want to grow the the channel. I want to make make something out of it. I want to I want to do this full time, and I'm gonna do my best to put um, the best effort I can put and I do hope that everyone can join me on this journey I do appreciate it everybody who has uh, joined me um, for joining me so I do appreciate that um, I'm gonna continue on growing the channel um, like I said uh, always work on towards your dreams and right now my dream is to become a full-time content creator what does the big picture look like for you then? Big picture. Hmm. I think. <clears throat> hmm. Me at the streamer awards. <laughs> when I reach that, that I'll, I'll, that's when I'll say. You have to take your mom. Yeah, I've I've reached. Yeah, you, yeah you're gonna have to I've, take I've your, made it. Take her as a guest. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> sure. Closing statement. I would. Well, I truly like to, to uh, really thank everybody for um, joining me, uh, for subscribing. Um, you know, even those 20, 22 subscribers at the at the very start, I was very uh, thankful for for those who subscribed. Um, I will continue to keep on going, and um, once again, be if you have a dream. Um, Go for it. Do not give up on those dreams. Because those dreams make you the person today.